Hey, what's going on? It's your boy Dantana24, Future Show YouTube channel. As you can see right behind me, we have the Cyber Power PC. We just got this actual, uh, item in today, and it, it took them approximately almost two months to actually get it uh, due to the lack of shortages, due to scalpers and bots and stuff taking up the uh, RTS 3080s, the every graphics card. It's very difficult to get a graphics card at this moment in time, but finally we was able to get the graphics card. So this is my, I have not touched the only thing I've touched right now is just touch the, uh, the the top of it and tore it out just to make sure everything is intact but I have not actually took out the plastic or anything so we're gonna open this bad boy up check the components make sure we don't have any defaults anything that's wrong with it uh, and we will go from there uh, roughly I, I invested three thousand dollars for this PC so I'm looking forward to everything being intact if I if I've invested this much money it better be intact so so, uh, cyber power, uh, nothing personal towards you, but that's a lot of money of my personal money. I'm not sponsored by these guys whatsoever. So this is my hard earned money as a customer that I've actually invested in. So we're going to actually do a quick unboxing. I'm not going to fire this thing up. We're going to actually go from there. Uh, I might do another video with the, uh, actual lighting to check it, to see how everything tests out, do some tests on it, run a couple of games to see how I uh, operate and also check some temperatures here and there. I'm not the techie guy. So but I do have some common knowledge as far as PC components go. So just stay tuned and we will get back with you after I get this box off of this PC and we'll open it up and see how it looks, okay? Stay tuned. All right, we're gonna actually get into the unboxing. Hopefully y'all guys can actually see this. So we're gonna actually, as you can see, we still got the protective uh, foam inside of the PC. So we're gonna actually sit here, dive into the components and go from there. But first, before we get started, uh, it does come with a cyber power box. I mean, bag, I'm sorry. Uh, I didn't get the keyboard and stuff like that. You know, even though it was free, I mean, I think it would just been a waste of time. It would have just set up and collected dust. So I've already got a key keyboard and um monitor mouses and everything like that that I invested in so I didn't find no need in it uh, but as you can see you get your uh, you actually get a bridge a slot bridge even though I would not be doing any GPU slot configurations you do have the options with the Asus motherboard that I do have as well as um, you do have extra components like wires and stuff to the power supply um, and also a uh, backup let me find it. It's a backup um, USB that you have in here. Uh, I apologize, I'm not the best unboxer, so. Uh, where are you? Here we go. So you get a actual USB that, that you can actually sit here just in case if you uh, lose everything and you have to start fresh, you have a USB recovery, Windows recovery, uh, USB. This is very important. I, 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 I live by this because things can happen. Things can get broke. You know, never, everything is not meant to last forever. So uh, other than that, let's get started. So as you can see, the sticker is still on here. We're gonna actually tear it off. Uh, this is tamper, uh, tamper glass, so you gotta be very careful with this. So if you don't mind, I'm gonna just step away from the camera for a minute and we will uh, actually get back at it. So let me just take my time taking this off. So just bear with me, because I do not want to tear this up. This is actual glass. This is glass. Yes, this is glass. So we're gonna take this off and go from there. Oh yeah, that is glass. That is straight up glass. Um, hopefully nothing has been torn. Okay, good. So the inside also has um, <clears throat> the foam as well, the plastic to protect it. So I'm glad they did that because that would have been a mess. But uh, other than that, I will be right back. Okay, so now we have the foam which is inside. This is actually used to protect the components that's inside and stuff like that. So hopefully everything is intact. Let's cross our fingers and hope that everything is good. We can look at the components and we'll go from there. Uh, before we get started, I'm gonna actually give you a list of components that I have. So therefore, uh, 
you know basically what you're looking at. Um, and if you got any questions in the comments below, you can um, ask the questions below. Uh, so as you can see, this is my invoice. I'm not gonna share all my personal information, but as far as what I have, you do get the NVIDIA Call of Duty Cold War, Cold War, which actually comes with the graphics card. And then as well, you get a USB 16 gig uh, Windows recovery. Um, I have an AMD Ryzen 5900X with a 3.0 gigahertz, 4.8 gigahertz turbo, turbo with 12 cores, 20, 24 threads. I got a WD Blue 4 terabyte uh, hard drive with a 50, 50, 500 gigabyte um, blue PCIe NVMe M2.2 SSD, as well as another, which they had a free offering going with another four terabyte hard drive and a one terabyte Samsung uh, SSD. Then you get the Kingston. I got 32 gigs of Kingston Hyper Predator RGB, along with the CyberPower Master uh, Liquid light 360 millimeter rgb water cooler and i do have the cyber power and that's not irrelevant but then you have the uh fantex the red and black cable um just to make it look more professional hopefully they did a pretty good job on that i have the evga uh, 3080 ultra gaming 10 gigabit uh gddr6 so i was able to get that and everything else is pretty much the same so they did replace i noticed they they offered a 1000 um 1000 psu but it was like a off brand some brand i'd never heard of and i heard a lot of bad reviews even though it was cheaper on the end i chose to go with a gigabyte 850 but I guess they didn't have that in stock at the warehouse, so they replaced it with a Coast Course Air uh, 850 Gold fully module power supply. So, I mean, kudos for them for even doing that. I mean, I didn't even know they changed it, but they did. So, thank you, Cyber Power, for doing that. So, we're gonna get started. We're gonna open this up, and we're gonna see how everything looks. Please do not be broke. man this is nice this is nice guys this is tight so check this out so you got the red ass sync on the um EVGA RTX 3080. This is a big graphics card. Man, look at this graphics card. Then also too, you have the um, the 360 millimeter. Also, this is RGB as well. This is RGB as well. It seemed like it might be able to get great cooling. So I don't think it's gonna be any issues as far as cooling solution goes and stuff like that to that nature. But we will find out on that. Uh, I do wanna add my uh, um, Abra Media um, capture card into this, so hopefully we'll be able to do that as well. So hopefully that won't be an issue. I don't think it will um, with the setup that I have. So I think this actually comes off, so I should be able to get that in there. But other than that, man, I am happy, man, about this. I'm not seeing any issues. It doesn't seem like anything is loose whatsoever. So I actually look forward to firing this thing up and we're gonna see how this stuff goes. So just stay tuned and we'll get back with you guys. Hey, thank you for watching my video, man. If you find this video very informative, please press the like button. Also subscribe for more channels if you wanna actually see the uh, actual fire up of the CyberPower PC with the RTS 3080. Uh, so if you had time to sit here and just watch this video, I hope it wasn't too long, but I hope you guys enjoy it. If you have a question or anything, leave a comment below and I'll be trying to get back with you if um, I'm not at work. Hey, y'all have a peace and wonderful day. Take care, guys.